Hello, Scorpio. It's my lady from a lady's way tarot, and I'm coming to do your bi-weekly reading for the weeks of 9 4 through 9 18 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. Alright, I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Um, other than that, make sure you check your sun, moon, and rising signs. And let's get this show on the road. Alright, so what's going on for the Scorpio? Scorpio, 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 Scorpio love reading for the weeks of 9, 4 through 9, 18, 2017. Scorpio, Scorpio love reading 9, 4 through 9, 18, 2017. Alright, so... There's something going on with like, um, it might just be some kind of just sexual relationship going on, okay? Or somebody got some kind of soulmate connection going on here. Let's see. Okay, so somebody is letting go of you, so, nope. Yeah, I'm feeling like this might have been somebody you thought you had a connection with, but, or they thought they had a connection with you, but bottom line, somebody, it was just a relationship, it was just all sexual and somebody let go of you, okay? But somebody in a relationship thought it was more. Okay, so it's saying like... The reason why somebody let somebody go, it you knew what the reason was. Let's see what these reasons, what are these visions about? What are these visions about for the Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio? What are these visions about for Scorpio? Mm. Okay, so it seems like something was going on and you kind of felt it, but then somebody that's close to both of you guys end up telling you. Okay. I got two cards over here. Yeah, so once you heard this secret, you was on your way. You're like, okay, well, now it's time to find something new. All right, what is this a drift about? What is this a drift about? What is this letting go about for the Scorpio 49? 4, 4 through 9, 18, 2017. Okay. <clears throat> so it seems like. It was just a purely sexual relationship for you, I'm feeling like. And it seems like somebody told you or told the person you were dealing with that you were using them. And then it seems like you kind of had the feeling that they was going to say something, but you really didn't know. That's what it's looking like at this point. All right, let's go. Yeah, so this person definitely left you because they felt like you was using them. But, I mean, I don't know if it, you was using them for materialistic things, but, I mean, I, it seems like all you wanted was sex from this relationship. And you were giving this person stuff, but they let go because all you wanted was sex. That's what I'm, that's what I'm feeling here. Um, all right, well, whatever this situation, it was going on for a long time. It wasn't like a nude link, so at least uh, three, six months. So it's been going on for a while. Wow. So um, the person that left you really cares about you. You felt like you could just give this person money or whatever or things to shut them up so you can get what you want, but they wanted more than that. Uh Okay, one more. 
Wow, so this person feels like they sacrificed a lot for you. So I just automatically got the feeling they left their family for you. <clears throat> but all you wanted was sex. Oh, yeah, definitely. You're like, uh, it, this just makes me feel like you don't care that they leave. Like, up oh, next. On to the next. That's what I feel like. All right, so what's going on for the Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio? Love reading, Scorpio, love reading. What's going on for a Scorpio love reading for the weeks of 9, 4 through 9, 18 and 2017? Scorpio love reading 9, 4 through 9, 18, 2017. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio love reading. Mm. Misunderstandings. Yeah, sounds about right. All right, King of Cups. Somebody is trying to act like they're understanding. Uh. Okay, yeah, but here, whoever just wanted sex, they were successful. Like, it was a miscommunication, but I had an understanding. But I got what I want. Mm-mm. Mm -mm, Scorpio. Wow. So you had success but no victory. I guess maybe because um you wanted this to keep going but they let you go. And you're like, oh well. Alright, so you could have been dealing with an Aries, possibly, possibly not, or um just some unstructured person. Alright? So first we got the two of cups. And it's reversed. It says, um, this card is a union of two people coming together at a time of understanding between the two. Okay. Now we got the King of Cups. That's the King. Yes, it is. A person of great education with many inner abilities indicates uh, you receive good advice and generosity from someone soon. Okay. So we got the Six of Staffs. This says, um, you may expect some good news very soon concerning decisions you may face. <clears throat> Your hard work will pay off in victory. That's crazy. All right, so the Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords, Ace of Swords. Uh-uh. All right, the Ace of Swords says, a notice of new birth. Oh, increase in family. And marriage or adoption and relocation. Okay. So, I, I guess that's why it's not a victory. You thought you was getting off a uh, Scott Clean, Scott Clear, whatever they say, and mess around and somebody's pregnant. <clears throat> okay. Ooh. Okay, so we got the. Woo. We got the. Uh, what is that? I don't even. I can't even read right now. Uh, the Emperor. Yes. It says. It's re reverse. So it says generosity and manipulation. Yes, yeah, so now this person going to be using you to get what they want. I mean, they left a party to be with you. Um, you, they got pregnant and they couldn't deal with your relationship, like the way you have relationships. So they left you and, and they pregnant. <laughs> so it's like, you got what you want at first, but now that this baby is coming, it's like, uh, not so much, but that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Other than that, have a great week.